Performing an energy analysis for schematic design follows the same process as the basic workflow presented previously, but your model uses a combination of massing element and detailed architectural elements. Open your schematic model in Revit. To perform on the energy analysis, go to the Analyze tab and first set the location by clicking on the location icon. Set it to One Market Street in San Francisco. Then, review the energy settings by clicking on the icon. Make sure you're using the default analysis mode, use conceptual masses and building elements. It is important to note that Insight comes with a robust set of broadly applicable default parameters, and it is generally not necessary to change anything in the energy setting at this stage. However, should you need more advanced setting, you can customize the settings here and you can refer to the Revit help topic on energy setting for more information. Click on Create Energy Model to create an updated energy model that takes into consideration your schematic design element, such as wall, floor, roof, and so on. Click on the Generate icon to generate an insight based on the updated energy analytical model. By clicking this icon, it opens a window asking you either to use your existing energy model, which you just created, or to update your energy model. Because you haven't made any changes to your model since creating your energy analytical model, just click on Use Existing Energy Analytical Model. To access the result of the simulation in the web-based Insight interface, use one of the three following methods. In Revit, you can click on the Optimize as icon as shown here. In your Analysis Complete email you receive, you can click on the link. Or you can go to the insight.autodesk.com and sign into your A360 account and click on Insight, All Uncategorized Category, and click on your model. 